guys, welcome back to We Watch the Movie. I'm Mike. I'm Jay. And this is Velvet Buzzsaw. Literally, the name, it sounds like the Xbox auto-generates your gamer tag for the first time. And you're like, I just don't have time to be bothered. <laughs> Mine's like fucking like, Funny, fuzzy like bunny. December fuzzball. Yeah, it'd be like Velvet Buzzsaw 3. <laughs> This is going to be on Netflix on February 1st, and we're going to try to get a review out for it as soon as possible because you'll be shocked. You'll be shocked! Yeah. Halfway through this, when you see what this trailer actually is, it's Jake Gyllenhaal, my friend. Ooh. It's by the, the writer director of Nightcrawler, ah. and it's also got Rene Russo. Still Does hot. it have James Bagaboy? No. Oh. Why, why would it? Because it it's make... Nightcrawler. What did you do with Elijah? Suck it, fuck it, and touch it! It looks like shit. Get it out of here. Get that bitch off the monitor. <laughs> Critique is so limiting and emotionally draining. I am hoping you find something to explain what's happening. Which one's better? One or two? Better or worse, no different. No different. I am quite curious. To Are you still hungover? I think sober hasn't been good for him. Pierce was in the full bloom of alcoholism here. Exactly. Never should have quit drinking. <laughs> no originality. No courage. My opinion. I can't save you. I found something. Who did these? The mesmeric. A uh, guy upstairs, he died. And you just took them? He had my family or friends. I can make you rich. It's brilliant. The man has people ready to kill. Have you ever heard of an artist named Ventral D? Get smoking here. No, not in our records, and we have everyone. The artist like used to be the reddish blocks. You ever notice anything about this painting? You look at it long enough, it moves. What the fuck? What the fuck is that? I know he's got nice shoulder muscles. I thought that's true. Disgust for the world of money. We spent decades in a psychiatric hospital for the criminally insane. Some sort of power. Oh, don't back it. Mr. Hot Pants. Spirit. It's connected to his art. <gasps> Holy f oh, those monkeys are vicious. Holy goddamn strange is going on. <laughs> <laughs> this is the slaughterhouse. Are you aware that Dee's asked that all his art be destroyed? Help! Get rid of it. Oh, put your arm in silver balls. I can't save you. Holy shit. People thought she was part of an exhibit. We're trending on Instagram. It's a major hit. Who knew art could be so dangerous and I beautiful? I like it. It looks fucking good, man. Yeah. Like I, I don't know what what to really think about it, but I'm I'm guessing it's kind of like what the, you know he uses like magic to make the paintings, and it somehow takes control of the human and puts them in there. They're I, all I fucking haunted. God. Picasso's got to come up with new shit. Yeah, it's a bunch of haunted paintings. Someone just watched it, <laughs> the new it, and they were like, "That's a good fucking idea." Plus the nun, how they fucked up the yeah. nun. They could have done something super scary with that idea, and it, they pooped on it, and made it a national treasure. So I think that dude, this dude's a hell of a writer. I, I'm surprised as shit that this movie would go straight to Netflix, yeah. but they must have looked at it and saw, you know, it's way too hard to market this, where it's several different genres. But look how good Bird Box did. I mean, and it wasn't theatrically released, and they don't have to pay all the extra money for the theater run and all that stuff. Yeah. So it's easier. I think a lot. I think you're going to start seeing a lot bigger actors, or like, well, big actors such as Jake Gyllenhaal and Sandra Bullock continue that trend, and you're going to have more and more Netflix original shows that are like movie quality. Yeah. And that's that's cool for everybody, you know, for your ten dollars a month. Fuck yeah. Yeah. Coupons. Yeah. Deals. Yeah. But I'm just Come excited more. to see uh, that team do a little bit of horror, even though I'm not sure how much how much the horror element's gonna be, or some Jumanji shit. Look, 
let me, I'll be honest with you. If it wasn't Jake Gyllenhaal and Rene Russo and, and Dan Gilroy or Tony Gilroy, whichever it is, uh, if it wasn't this team and I saw this trailer with completely different people, I'm not sure how into it I would be because it's kind of weird and kind of no. out there. But because it's them, I'm super fucking jacked for it. And I think it's going to surprise people with a finger in the butt. Oh, Velvet Buzzsaw. Yeah, that's what you call it. <laughs> Ooh, the Velvet Buzzsaw. Velvet Buzzsaw. I stick my finger up your Why butt you in the office, Pam. Why are you finger in me butt? Yeah. Finger butt holes. Comment down below with your all thoughts. We love your fucking faces. And if you're new to the channel, click that subscribe button and get some goddamn wham. That sounds like a plan. Critique is so limiting. Come on over, come in Velvet Buzzsaw. We watched a movie. Yeah. We watched a movie. We watched it. We watched a movie.